In the heart of ancient East Africa, around 300 BCE, a coalition of black Tanzanian traders sought to revolutionize the way goods moved across the vast expanse of Lake Victoria. Tired of losing precious wares to unpredictable waters and treacherous storms, these ingenious traders envisioned a solution far ahead of its time, a sunken causeway. Gathering local engineers and skilled laborers, they began a monumental project, using massive stones and sturdy timber to build a submerged pathway that would allow carts and porters to safely traverse the shallower parts of the lake. With each passing season, the causeway grew longer, snaking beneath the water's surface. It became a guarded secret among the traders, who used it to move ivory, gold, and exotic spices between settlements along the lakeshore, avoiding dangerous currents and river pirates. The causeway transformed regional trade, allowing communities to flourish and ideas to travel further than ever before. Local legends speak of the path beneath the waves, though few outsiders ever knew its true nature. Centuries passed, and the causeway gradually fell into disuse as political changes and new routes emerged. Over time, the structure was forgotten, overtaken by silt, weeds, and the passage of history. Yet, the memory of the trader's ingenuity lived on in stories whispered by lakeside elders, who spoke of a sunken road built by ancestors whose wisdom rivaled even the greatest civilizations of the ancient world. In recent years, as divers and archaeologists explored the depths of Lake Victoria, the remnants of this incredible causeway have begun to emerge from the murky waters. Stone blocks, ancient timbers, and artifacts hint at a lost chapter of African innovation. The discovery is rewriting history, proving that black Tanzanian traders not only mastered commerce but also engineering feats that rival those of any ancient society.